An agency relationship is created when one person, known as the principal, allows another person, known as the agent, to act on the principal's behalf, subject to the principal's control. Such a relationship can be created with or without the exchange of consideration or value. Additionally, during the existence of the relationship, the principal is liable to third parties for physical injuries caused by the agent's negligent acts. In the 1937 case of Gorton v. Doty, the Supreme Court of Idaho considered whether a teacher who allowed a football coach to drive her vehicle could be liable for the coach's negligence in causing an accident. On September 21, 1934, Charlotte Doty was a teacher at Soda Springs High School, which was scheduled to play a football game at Paris. The team's coaches planned on using their vehicles to travel to and from Paris, but there was a shortage of vehicles to transport all of the players. Knowing of this shortage, Doty volunteered to allow one of the team's coaches, Russell Garst, to use her vehicle to drive players to and from the game. Doty told Garst that he was the only one allowed to drive her vehicle. Doty didn't receive any compensation for the use of her vehicle and didn't assert any other control over its use. While driving Doty's vehicle back from the game, Garst got into an accident while going around a sharp curve. At the time, Richard Gorton, a junior at Soda Spring High School and a member of the football team, was a passenger in Doty's vehicle. As a result of the accident, Garst died and Gorton suffered significant injuries. Subsequently, Gorton's father, R.S. Gorton, sued Doty both individually and on behalf of his son as his guardian ad litem in district court based on negligence. The case went to a jury trial, and the judge instructed the jury that it could find for Gorton if it found that Garst was Doty's agent at the time of the accident. In response, Doty moved for a mistrial, claiming that the judge improperly instructed the jury on the law. The court denied the motion and the jury returned a verdict in favor of Gorton for nearly $6,000. Doty then appealed to the Supreme Court of Idaho, 